When we study collisions, we use the coefficient of restitution as a measure of how much kinetic energy is lost during the interaction between the two colliders. A coefficient of 1 means that none of the kinetic energy is lost and we have an elastic collision. We can think of this as the bounciest of all possible collisions. And a coefficient of restitution of 0 means that we lose the most kinetic energy possible. It doesn't necessarily mean that we lose all the kinetic energy, because we still have to keep the total momentum conserved. A coefficient between 1 and 0 means that some of the kinetic energy is lost and we have an inelastic collision. The lost kinetic energy usually crumples the colliders or escapes as sound or heat. But a coefficient of 0 always results in the two colliders sticking together and moving with the same velocity after the collision. This type of collision goes by many names perfectly inelastic collisions, maximally inelastic collisions, and my personal favorite, sticking collisions. We saw an example of a sticking collision in the previous episode when we used a coefficient of restitution of zero with identical colliders moving at opposite velocities toward each other. We can get the same effect if we double one of the collider's masses and cut its velocity in half. The total momentum of the two colliders has to remain zero, and in this case, that means stopping each other from moving. But if we give a little increase to one of the velocities, we can see the two colliders stick together and move at the same velocity after the collision. No matter what combination of mass and velocities we provide, a coefficient of zero always results in the two colliders sticking together. You can think of these colliders as being sticky or having latching mechanisms like train cars. You have now learned how to model sticking collisions using vPython along with inelastic collisions and elastic collisions. Follow the link in the description below to find a set of activities to help you learn more about collisions.